Hello, sports fans. What's happening? Thanks for hanging out with your boy, the sports judge. The latest news in the NFL world is Jim Harbaugh. Yes, he is returning to the NFL after leading Michigan to the national title. The Chargers are hiring him to be their next head coach. I like this hire. I like this hire a lot. I like it as a whole. Excellent hire. New blood. New ideas. A good defensive and offensive-minded uh, head coach who can build a positive culture in L.A. I can't wait to see what he can do with Justin Herbert. I think Harbaugh can do what he did at Michigan in L.A. and bring the franchise back from mediocrity to a winner. I think he will take the Chargers to new heights. A Super Bowl is definitely possible this was the right move by Dean Spanos. I will finally give him credit for once. He made the right move here. A proven, tenacious coach who knows the game. He did a fantastic job at Michigan. He did what he was set out to do. He's a Michigan man. Uh, that's where he graduated from. That's where he played his college football. He got Michigan back on top. Now it's time for him to chase that Super Bowl again. I saw this coming. He was always going to go back to the NFL. It was it was coming sooner or later. It was only a matter of time that he would leave Michigan for another crack at the NFL. A return to the pros has been in the works since the championship game. Speculation grew in recent weeks over a potential return to the NFL. And Harborough himself was coy about his future ahead of both the Rose Bowl and the National Championship game. He didn't say much about it. He didn't have much to say about it. But now we know uh, what his next move was. He moved in silence. Everybody was wondering what would happen. I don't think anybody saw the Chargers. Uh, the, the conversation was that he was interested in, you know, getting another shot at the NFL, I kind of knew he would leave Michigan after guiding the Wolverines to a national title. He does, he does, you know, what he needed to do there. He goes out as a winner and, and now he hits the lottery. He already has a, a quarterback. Now you have to try and guide this team, which is filled with talent and promise. Herbert and Harbra. Is very interesting. You got your franchise quarterback. Herbert has franchise quarterback stuff. They have playmakers on defense. That defense under Brandon Staley didn't play up to its capabilities. He has the personnel already. Jim Harbaugh has everything to his advantage. Jim Harbaugh has had success in the NFL. Never won the Super Bowl, but got there with the 49ers. They went to three NFC championship games. This is a good thing in bringing in someone who runs a 3-4 defense. If he can't save the Chargers, no one can. He couldn't ask for a better situation. This is a massive win for Jim Harbaugh. It gives him the best chance to get on a contender and, and not some five-year rebuild. Now you're not having to worry about rebuilding a team. Uh, that can take forever. The other thing is, he also gets away from Michigan. A, a problem that will be left, uh, this is a program that will be, excuse me, a program that will be left in shambles and lucky to win anything in the upcoming years. They have all these investigations following them. The opportunity presented, presented to him obviously worked out for Harborough, and now he gets to come to L.A. I think he's walking into perhaps not only the most attractive head coaching job available, but one that's built for long-term success. I think what you have now is a quarterback who can prosper, grow, and reach a new level of play under Jim Harborough. This actually makes sense if it's a if it's a team like the Chargers, who is built for a run. The FC West just got a whole lot tougher. Things got a lot interesting. 
I like Jim Harbaugh for this job. I think the Bears missed a great opportunity. I was saying that that would have been a home run, a home run higher for them. They missed out on them. The Chargers snatched them. Uh, they got themselves a great coach. I think he'll do a good job um, in L.A. And we're, we're seeing coaches come in and turn things around fairly quickly. Um, it doesn't take long to see a turnaround um, on these franchises. We've seen it with the Houston Texans. Um, you know, we've seen it. We've seen it with uh, Jacksonville. You you can throw Doug Peterson's name in there. Um, we've seen it with multiple teams. So I like this move a lot. I think I think I think the Chargers hit the jackpot. I think they hit a home run with this hire. I think it was a great move for the Chargers. I really really didn't see it coming. Um, but Jim Harbaugh will do a good job. He understands the game of football. He knows how to coach. He's been there before. He's done it before. He coached in the NFL, had a lot of success. This is a great hire. You know, a lot of credit goes to the Chargers for getting this one right. Thanks for watching, everyone. Really appreciate the love and support. We'll talk very soon. Have a good night, everyone.